Welcome back to Piranha Outdoors. This week, we're going to do a North Shore survival episode. Yep, I thought of it. Purple's going to do some of it, too. We're going to try to survive for three hours yes. on the shore. Our only food is a half of a bag of peanut butter M&M's, <laughs> some juice boxes, and some other various snacks. Yes, pretty much. To not freeze, we're going to try to start a fire. All we have for that is dryer lint, paper, and some really dry cedar. We have some wax worms and some looper bugs. We're going to try to catch a fish. If we do, we maybe we'll cook it. I thought of that idea. Do you cook think? It, yeah. Spear it with a knife and then cook it near the fire. Do you, do you think we can survive? Yes, I think I could survive for three hours. Stay tuned to find out. Step one to our survival is to get heat. Heat is needed. Check. Yes. Step two, try to procure some fish. Yes. Step three, is we always need water, but we can drinking that water. Yep. Stay tuned. 20 oh. minutes in. Yep. We're starting to get a little hungry. We got the a little smoky. We got the fire going good. I delivered all the monster's eggs. So warmth isn't a problem anymore. Monster's eggs delivered. Can we catch a fish? Yeah, but we have more kinds of monsters, but I'm in charge of the fire right now. Reed's the fire warmth guy. And, and if the fire's okay and monsters need my help, I can help them. Stay tuned. Take care of my eggs. I mean there. Half hour in, we realize it's too windy to fish, so we're gonna have to go on exploration mission to find more food and deliver more monsters. Yep. Good luck, little beetle. Oh, hey, look, a mammoth nest. I already delivered one. Okay. Okay, I'm coming down. Reed is diving in to the last of the peanut butter M&Ms. Those were supposed to be for day what, like two or day three. Times are getting tough. I don't know if we're gonna make it three hours. What do you think? Um, well, yeah, probably not. Next to the big blank, in this big blank, bunch of monsters called toe jammers in them. And so last Tuesday, around here, there was a big, some really tough winds that caused a storm. Messed up all their eggs, and now I'm trying to get them back into the spots. I thought that we were the only ones out here surviving. And there's Look at these guys. Reed said his fish is done cooking. Yes. So he's gonna give us a taste test. Yes. Okay, go. I tried it and. Mm. What do you think? I really like. Tell the camera. I I I really like the taste. 
Is it something you can survive on for at least the next 45 minutes? Probably, yeah. Because mm -hmm. I really like it a lot. It, uh, YouTube, are you not ex impressed? If you watch this, thanks for subscribing. Hit a like below and please subscribe. Sometimes surviving is exhausting.